What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Coco Lili, and I am back with my promise to you of a leave-in conditioner that I picked up on Black Friday. So, here it is. Bath Silk and Honey Latte. I have the Nectarine Vanilla. Let me see if you can pick up this. There you go. Yeah, Nectarine Vanilla. This smells like Nectarine and Vanilla. Not an artificial Nectarine and Vanilla. It's like a Nectarine Vanilla dessert. It's very sweet, fruity, sexy, sensual. It's just very nice. Very nice. And I, let me show you the, uh, the scent. Very nice. The product is very nice. Let me show you the texture. When I first got this, I was like, uh-oh, it's a little bit too thin. It's probably not going to do anything because my hair um, requires some pretty um, serious um, moisture. If it's not good enough, it's going to definitely dry out within a matter of a few hours. Uh, my hair is relatively on the high porosity side. It's getting better because I haven't heat styled for like eight or nine months now. <clears throat> and in case you guys aren't familiar with me or my channel, I have not relaxed my hair since June of 2010. So Coming up on my third anniversary, I did not do a big chop. I just did gradual trims, some of them pretty major, but I still did, you know, just a course of trims. And, um, yeah, I trim my hair all the time. So I'm pretty sure that I have no more relaxer in my hair. I actually just did a trim, um, I want to say probably less than a week ago, maybe five days or so. Um, but... My hair has problems. It's not perfect. Nobody says. And uh, so I'm always looking for a better, um, lightweight leave-in. You know, something to really start my week out right. <laughs> this is amazing. Um, I am a product junkie, so I can't promise that, like, you know, I'll use this forever and ever. But I have already repurchased it because I like it so much. Um, it makes my hair really shiny. I shine that and moisture that lasts for probably a good three days. Put this in my hair with um, a, well, you know, you guys know that I'm a big layer. I layer up my stuff. So my first step and um, favorite step right now for my liquid, which is my first step, Red juice from Orion. I've been using this basically um, every couple days, probably since I got this at Black Friday. Um, it doesn't matter what else I'm using. The Greg juice, uh, the scent of the Greg juice doesn't interfere with anything else, whether I'm using chocolate based products or fruity based or bubblegum or whatever. It doesn't interfere and it does the job. I also love that I can dilute it with water and it works even better than it does on its own. So win-win. So back to the back of the latte. Um, I don't know what else there is to say. Let me tell you the ingredients. Distilled water, babasu oil, castor oil, kubuasu butter, shea butter glycerides, raw honey, um, some other kind of honey that I can't pronounce. <laughs> And BPMS, material alcohol, fragrance, uh, butylene glycol. Um, there's some hydrolyzed silk in here towards the bottom and um, something else that I can't pronounce. But the ingredients are really good. I mean, that's a pretty short ingredients list. And this um, company is a nice company to order from, to work with. They will ship your products pretty fast. Um, I've probably ordered from them three or four times. Uh, probably four actually, and the only time I had a slight delay was on Black Friday. That one took a little bit of time, but they were so sweet about it. They handled it so professionally um, that I couldn't complain. So what's in my hair right now? So you know the first two things I use in my hair. And the thing that I use to seal is a new butter that I got from a company called Bell Amore Blend. I've had this, let me see if you can see it better. 
if they're whipped buttercream. And I heard about this from Hey Friend Hey. I follow her on Facebook. And um, she said this is like in her top five. And then she said it was $6. $6. I said, well, okay, I'm getting a couple. I trust her opinion, if you can't tell. And she was right. I have, um, I'm sniffing this. I have the honey vanilla fragrance. Um, I can't remember how many um, fragrance options there are. Let me show you what this looks like, though. This, it's not hot in here, okay, guys? Um, it's cold where I live. So this is what it looks like. Look at that. It's like butter that's been in the microwave almost it's got a lot of oil in it but it's not too oily i i don't know <sighs> i don't really know um what the ingredients are to tell you guys right now you have to go um look them up i believe their website is bellamoreblends.com if it's not google it but um yeah here it's on the bottle guys bellamoreblends.com Six dollars. The ingredients are white. There's even argan oil in here. I do remember that from, um, you know, the shopping trip. But I'm gonna buy some more of this. I like it quite a bit. Um, it goes really well. This is a great team. The Bellamore blends with buttercream with the bath with the honey latte. Uh, yeah, they go really well together. Um, I wish that you guys could see my hair a little bit better. But bottom line, I'm happy with the way my hair looks. I'm happy with the progress that I'm making with my two strand twists because I've been two strand twisting my hair almost 90% of the time. There's been very little outdoor exposure to the elements this winter, um, and I'm making really great progress. So um, if you haven't started protective styling, now's the time to try it out. You know, give yourself a good, you know, six to eight weeks and by the summertime you're gonna have some additional length for Tintin to play with and you know just luxuriate flaunt all summer with your wash clothes or whatnot because um I never thought that my hair would be like armpit length curly. I couldn't even get armpit length with you know straight hair before ever in my life. So um, I'm a very happy camper and just in case you guys are wondering I'm still a one girl. That's all I wash my hair with. And um, when I wash my hair tomorrow, I am going to use 613. Uh, I love this because it kind of kills two birds with one stone. I did a review on this before, and I still love it. I love that I can actually use it to get my hair clean. And then I can go back in if I have time, which I make time nowadays to do it. But I can go back in and do a deep conditioner if I want to. So, um, yeah, if you're still looking for a protein treatment, I suggest you try 613 and make sure that you have a moisturizing protein free DC to use afterwards just in case. I mean, this never dried my hair out even without deep conditioning afterwards. But, you know, just as a precaution to give your hair extra boost, I always uh, deep condition mine no matter what I use. So, anyway, that's all I have today. I just want to get back and let you guys know what's up with me. I hope everybody's well. Okay. Bye.